Hey guys, Dustin Slade here in Denver, and I want to show you how to use this Traffic Monster software that is really cool. So I'm going to show you how to log in and do it. You need to make sure that you're logged into the software. You open the software, you log into your Facebook account here, and once you're inside, you're going to go to the Graph Search Domination tab, either uh, scroll through it side to side here, or you can uh, use the drop down menu here. And these are all the softwares included in here, guys. Amazing. And, uh, anyways, um, what you're going to do is search for people you may know. And what it'll do is it'll automatically try and put you into search for someone you thought you may know or that use this search term to try and get on the search engine. Uh, I don't know this person. I don't know this rock band. I don't know this TV show or community. If you go all the way down to the bottom, um, you have the little search tab there. Click on that, and that will take you to the actual search. And these are the friends that I know in here. And what I'm going to do is click on the See More button. And the See More button is going to give me a broader list of people. So these are already my friends. So see where it's retrieving my friends here. It may give you something like this. That's not what I'm looking for. Let's go back and do it again. People I may know. And scroll all the way to the bottom. Go here. And it well, it should come up with people who are not your friends, is what we're looking for. Okay, these are people who are not my friends right now. People I may know. I'm gonna click to see more. And it's going to pull up about nine people. So I want to I want to contact a few more from that. So what I'm going to do is auto scroll down. I put in five here, and I'm going to click auto scroll down. The software is going to make the browser scroll down in the see more tab about five times. Okay, now it's stopped over here. You can see, and I'm going to just look through here. Make sure I've already messaged the one, two, three, uh, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so I've messaged the first seven already. I'm going to have the list start at number seven. It'll start at number seven or number eight here. It'll probably start at number eight at Dave Prosser because there's a zero value here. Um, let's see. Let's. I'm going to start with a value of eight. Try and get to Sandy here. It'll be my first one. Then I chose a, a picture of um, an alien here. I'll show you this. This UFO, this guy, this uh, Air Force colonel that saw this UFO fly out of the center of the Earth, supposedly. So I just chose this. I clicked on. <clears throat> I clicked on upload the image. If you don't click on this, it won't upload it. Then, or you could add a file like a document or something. Then I'm going to go ahead and message 12 people starting at number 7. So from here on, I'm going to go down and start messaging them. And so I've got uh, this text written here that's going to message, wishing you a prosperous 2015 that is out of this world. And then I ask a question, how's it shaping up for you? Put a space in between there. Now this is ready to go to start messaging these people on this. I'm going to go ahead and click run. And let's watch it work. I've got it set for seven second interval in between here. 
which is a little bit higher on the high end. But there we go. Number eight starts with Dave. I think I messaged him already. I'm going to go ahead and click him out of there. And we'll let it keep going here with Sandy. Has to wait seven seconds in this interval. I can take this down a little bit for the video. So I can show you. We'll go through that first seven seconds. And then it will do an auto post as it does here. Sandy Root. Here it goes. Boom. Wishing you prosperous 2015. It's out of this world. How's it shaping up for you? And uploads the image there of the UFO. Upload. Upload. Should be a small image. You don't want a big image in here. And just click send. Successfully sent the message. It'll go to Shane next here. <clears throat> Click on Shane. Send him the message. How's it shaping up for you? Upload the image. Got it set to three seconds. So I'll be a little bit short. And click sent. Who's next? Sends the message, goes to the next person. Say right and Conley. Some pretty good people here. Seems to be grouping them now. Well, by the number of friends and sort of the top here. Put it in there. Messaging. Send. And so you get the the idea. I'm just going to go ahead and let it run in the background and keep sending these 12 people this message here. And I wouldn't get over crazy with it and start sending a bunch of messages. Um, you know, like in the hundreds, you will probably get a slapped and put in Facebook jail. But this is how you use this tool to automate. You don't have to type anything. You don't have to cut and paste, blah, blah. Sets it up and does it for you on autopilot. Very, very cool. So that's it, guys. Uh, we'll be back for the next training. And I look forward to sharing this software for you more and more. It's really, really cool. Thanks for watching. See you on the next video. Be sure to subscribe and share this video with your friends.